In this video, I'm going to teach you how to change the number of rings before voicemail on iPhone 14. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you would like to change the amount of times or the amount of rings before having a call go to voicemail on your iPhone 14, follow these steps. Keep in mind that for this video, I'm going to be using the career AT&T as an example. However, this should also work with other careers available. And if it doesn't, I'm going to give you an alternative. So for this method, you will have to call two specific numbers. The first one that you have to dial is going to be this. So star hash 61 hash. This will bring up a bunch of information about your calls. So you will see at the top, voice call forwarding when unanswered forwards to this number here including the country code which should be plus one if you are in the usa so all that you have to do here first is to note down the number that you see so note down this number either on a piece of paper or remember it you will have to call this number again so once you have this number noted down the second number that you have to dial is this one so it's going to be star star six one star then you have to include the number that you copied without the country code. So you place the number in here. So in full, it is going to be, for example, star, star, six, one, star, and then one, two, three, four, blah, 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 until you have the full number included that you copied from here into star, star, 30, and then hash. This 30 refers to the amount of seconds before a call goes into voicemail. You can try increasing this to 40 or 50, for example. Once you have this entire string of numbers typed out, you just have to dial it. Upon dialing this number, if you copied everything properly without the country code, then it should automatically adjust all of your calls to ring for 30 seconds before going into voicemail. Now, if this doesn't work, then it could be a problem with a specific career that you have. For this example, I chose AT&T, but if it doesn't work, even if you have AT&T or if you have a different one, the best course of action is going to be to call the customer support for your career and ask them to do this change or on their end. This isn't controlled by your iPhone. So by talking to the courier, they will be able to adjust this for you. I hope I was able to help you on how to change number of rings before voicemail on iPhone 14. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.